Welcome back to the Nissan Nismo Insider. I'm James Moffat, and on today's episode, I'm going to review the fluctuating fortunes of Nissan Motorsport at the Clipsal 500. The first round of the championship is one that is always met with great anticipation. It's the start of the new year, and you want to get it right. For two of our cars, it went well. For the other two, not so good. Both Rick and Todd Kelly finished the event inside the top 10 in the championship after they enjoyed three clean races. Rick sits 8th overall, while Todd is 10th, despite this giant leap of faith at the centre chicane. For my little buddy Michael Caruso, he had a disappointing weekend of results, including a large crash at the infamous Turn 8. And for myself, I finished 11th and 7th on Saturday, and was all set to claim another top 10 on Sunday until I got caught up in the Wink Up Mostert mess. With me now is the big dog general manager of racing, Scotty Sinclair. And one of the positives on the weekend, Scotty, was that at times we did show some good speed. Uh, just give us your thoughts on the weekend. Yeah, not bad, mate. Not bad. The, uh, the, the the near pole position on Sunday from your good self, obviously a highlight. But, uh, yeah, we were up and down. We are up and down. It's um, it's tough. We knew that. We, we think we made some small gains. and We saw that. But uh, we just need to get the consistency going. And a uh, few accidents mixed in the mix there. Um, Messed it up a little bit, but uh, generally pretty good. Yeah, I suppose that's probably the, the biggest talking point for ourselves is uh, a big workload between now and the Grand Prix with some uh, damaged cars, but I'm sure the boys are on top of that. Yeah, yeah, they're going they're going hard at the moment. It's so all our focus now will be on recuperating from the from Adelaide, and uh, we've got a real short turnaround after the Grand Prix as well to Tassie. I think we've only got about five days here as well, so that's uh, one of the shortest ones of the year. So. Uh, we're actually prepping for the next two events at the moment. 